welcome back to a new video today i'm right here with a new volkswagen caddy and we will do the test drive i will give you my feedback on how is to drive this new uh, volkswagen caddy if you want to see the review guys if you want to see how practical and how great this car it is for the family or for your company just uh, check out the other video click the subscribe button to see the notification when the review the full review interior exterior will come on my channel uh, until then guys if you are in switzerland uh, you can check out the cars and the price uh, i will leave the link in the description we are right here in Bern at amag so you can check out the price and they have some great discounts at, in this uh, period uh, before we start driving i want to give you some technical details and i want to go inside the car and i want to tell you guys um, that this model that i have it right now with me it's the uh, model that comes with a two a liter uh, TDI diesel engine 122 horsepower seven speed automatic gearbox DSG it comes with this new shift by wire transmission from Volkswagen it's really really great uh, to have a lot of space here in the middle uh, all about the interior exterior and all the explanation uh, you will find it in my other video with the review I will have a full review with the car so there you can find out more information about the dashboard about the the buttons the multimedia system and and uh, all that stuff but in this video it's all about driving uh, first of all those are the options also you will see it in the review the price of the car 41,500 francs uh, but this is not the new price because this car has already 3,000 kilometer probably the new price will be around 50,000 francs I will add the price in dollars as well um, yeah as I said uh, the, the, the engine has four cylinders guys uh, just keep in mind and it's euro six um, emission so yeah just as an extra information other than that I think I want to show you a little bit the exterior of the car before we start driving it and I want to tell you that they, they just did a great job with the exterior let me turn on the lights uh, for a second also it comes with this new uh, light system and buttons and, and it's just phenomenal I mean I love the new interior it's so modern it's so premium you don't even feel like this is a family uh, practical utility vehicle because yeah the shape of it it's a shape of an utility vehicle but to be honest guys you don't feel uh, when you see the car it's so modern it's out it has some some kind of features and elements that it looks really like a premium car and to be honest it, it was really impressive for me for example look at the front part of the car look at the grill down there look at the nice uh, new modern design down here in this area also full LED lights the car come with adaptive LED lights so this is really impressive in terms of light it's the latest technology even the turning signal look in a big way really cool the way they, they make those two lines and it's, it's really interesting um, they put a lot of work in this car I like very much also the front part here that helped the aerodynamic of the car so you don't have a grill here where the air come inside uh, for the aerodynamic it's also good because the air will go upside like that and it will help a lot uh, uh, the consumption because the shape of the car is not so uh, super aerodynamic the front uh, part and where where should be the grill it help a lot the aerodynamic and then you have the air intakes down here also the car come with radar for adaptive cruise control emergency brake and all that features but all about that in my other video guys just just check it out on my channel on the next days I will add also the full review in the back here the same story if you look a little bit closer you can see the LED light the nice new design of the light they look just gorgeous the way it's writing caddy uh, the Volkswagen logo the big tinted window in the back it's just just crazy and not only that but check this out guys open the door check this out how much space you have inside here it's pretty crazy and not only the space but the glass roof it's just phenomenal and not only that check this out this door have soft close guys check it out if you didn't close it good you will close automatic soft close something that you find it only on the premium premium cars so what do you think about that anyway um, 
the rims they, they are continental tires winter tires right now uh brake discs in the back in the front we have ventilated brake discs i will show you in the moment 16 inch rims those are 16 inch they are great for winter great for good consumption show, look at this in the front big huge brake discs ventilated brake discs so overall it also looks pretty nice i think they fit quite well on the car anyway enough with so many talk let's drive the car guys all right guys so let's drive this caddy here is the key by the way also guys the car come with a new key you can see this glossy nice fancy key that volkswagen use on the latest this model we see that on the volkswagen golf 8 we see that on the uh, volkswagen tiguan uh it's it's an amazing key it's super fancy so if you have this key uh yeah the people will think you drive a really expensive car it's it's a fancy fancy premium key and not only that it's fancy but check this out all you have to do have the key with you you can lock and unlock the car only by pressing the finger here so the Volkswagen bring on this new uh, caddy uh, the option this keyless entrance option and that's that's super nice you can see even the folding mirrors put the hand here and the car it's open and folding mirrors electrically folding mirrors it's really impressive to see on a family car all those options so i'm, I'm quite impressed that also the key is with me all you have to do is just leave it here it has a nice space for the key right here on the center console where the car come also with electronic handbrake auto hold uh, shift by wire transmission parking button start uh, engine button two usb-c ports uh, 12 volt port uh, amazing design on the dashboard it's super premium other than it's made by plastic everywhere the new cockpit the new multimedia system is just phenomenal check out on my other video guys on the review video there you find all the information about uh, the new cockpit the new multimedia system the way the buttons and the technology work because the technology in this car is just crazy even the lights button here on the side they are phenomenal even the led lights they are the best one on the market from volkswagen and this glass roof with the white roof interior is just crazy 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 led lights up here also with the touch you just have to put your finger here and uh, it will light up and huge space in the back there in the trunk but about trunk about that space check out my other video in this video it's about driving let me put the seat belt also it comes with this ergo seats uh, from Volkswagen and you can adjust in many many positions so that's that's really uh, impressive so you can adjust even the front part uh, they have side support they are super cool Comfy. they have this foam here uh, I think like 20 centimeter and it's super super comfy they are wide enough long enough they are just perfect they are manual adjustable keep in mind that but you can adjust the position up down the way you want it so that's really impressive even what is impressive is the new steering wheel with a new logo with the controllers here cruise control controllers for the display but all about that in other video press the brake start the engine as you see before uh, this model here it comes with a two liter diesel engine tdi combined with this uh, dsg transmission seven speed gearbox that is awesome uh, it works really really good i have to tell you that guys um, also the new multimedia system uh, from volkswagen it's it's super good i'm kind of i'm i'm becoming a fan of it i like it very much i like the way the way it show everything it's so modern it's like a tablet uh, i don't even need to tell you that the cockpit is nice and good and you can customize the way you want it from here you can change the views you can choose whatever view you want if you want to see the uh, navigation you can see it if you want to see the, the cruise control uh, adaptive cruise control and wherever you want to see you can change it from there but all about that you will find it in other video in this video it's all about driving and yeah let's see how it's drive first impression as i sit here inside i can see that i have an amazing amazing visibility guys so in the mirrors great big mirrors uh big windows huge windows even on the back there huge windows and i have a lot of light a lot of space here on my head space it's also huge uh it's crazy impressive and also it's sunny day and you can see this 
tinted windows they are really good anyway uh, the reverse camera put it in reverse you can see the car come with a reverse camera uh, parking sensors it comes with radar for adaptive cruise control emergency brake also you have the, those lines here for example when you want to park the car it will really show you everything really clear there so it's the same as on the Volkswagen Golf for example uh, 8 the newest is one anyway let's drive it put it in park and let's driving it I will miss I think we all we will miss this diesel engine sound in the future in 10 years we will all miss this sound uh, so we have to enjoy it now uh, while we can because we will not see so many diesel cars on the on the market in the future but I like this torque and this is a great utility family car uh, if you do long trips if you want to carry many things if you drive a lot on the highway uh, and many kilometers the diesel engine will help you get some amazing consumptions and you can save uh, a lot of money so it's still a great option uh, uh, to buy today also first impression i like very much the suspension and the fact that the car come with this 16 inch rims and the winter tires help a lot uh, for the suspensions um, and i like it i like the way it feels you don't even feel those bumps that's that's quite impressive i like that very much check this out really huge bumps but the car is doing a great job at at keeping them um under control and uh, you feel really comfortable here on those seats you feel like in an suv to be honest it gives you that feeling of suv yeah that that's my impression but uh, you have much better visibility than an suv i feel like this windshield it's much bigger than an suv you have a better better visibility also on the on the multimedia system you have great visibility on the cockpit you have great visibility the car come with star stop engine uh, system as well i like the steering wheel very good quality uh, is the same steering wheel that volkswagen golf 8 have also if you want to see that review and test drive check it out on my channel i have it there and and the steering wheel it's awesome from here you can set the cruise control and other uh, settings from the cruise control you have even the pedals if you want to change the gear manually to have some fun with the car um, yeah uh, you have here the controllers to change as you see before different options on the cockpit there also here you have the the multimedia system we will talk about multimedia system a little bit later not now but other than that you have the armrest here that's awesome you can adjust it the way you want it um, it's quite cool quite cool plenty of space here in the in the center console to put your your phone or wherever you want to put there easy to maneuver uh, the feeling it's like like it's it's so light it feels really light this car and I think it's lighter than an SUV um, I don't know it feels like easy to, to, to drive here you have plenty of storage space uh, in the front there I think you have also yes huge huge space there in the front wow you can hear the gearbox is changing the gears just in the perfect place uh, I think they choose the comfort you, you cannot change the driving modes in this car like you can do in Golf in Volkswagen Golf 8 for example where you can change the driving mode in, in Echo or Comfort on Sport this one it has only one mode and I think this they choose to have the comfort mode because the gears are changing not too early not too late it's changing just in the perfect moment to give you the perfect comfort and and that's good also on the roundabouts here is doing a great job it stay good on the road yes here you can hear a little bit how they change the gears it's doing a great job also visibility in the mirrors it's, it's just good yeah let's see how it stay on the curves those are 
here it's kind of an aggressive curve um, and I'm really curious about that okay not bad not bad not bad not bad and the, the seats are really good because they have that side support they will keep you uh, very good there yes as expected as expected guys you can hear a little bit of noise from outside you can hear on the upper side a little bit here in this area a little bit of noise but it's still it's not very bad but it's normal for the shape of the car to hear a little bit of air from outside let's set the cruise control from here you can set the cruise control pretty simple to 80 kilometers 83 just like that and then the car will keep the distance will keep the speed you can set it up very simple you can see it also there you have this adaptive cruise control where you can change the distance from you and the car in front you have the blind spot technology in the mirror there i think you can see it on the side of the mirror you have that blind spot technology and that's really really good let's go there on the right side right now great visibility in the mirrors in this mirror up here you have a very good visibility as well uh, not bad uh, so you can see quite quite clear behind you there i think it was a little bit cooler and nicer and better practical i should say uh, if they they will make this uh, mirror a little bit bigger here in the middle so you can see a little bit more or what of what happened behind there but still it's okay it's, it's not a big problem all right quite nice quite nice simple to 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 ride uh, the gearbox it's it's perfectly uh, adjusted for this engine easy to drive it stay quite good on the road but it feels comfortable comfort is the word for it uh, and practicality those two words I think they characterize this new Volkswagen Caddy also you have a tall driving position you feel like you are in an SUV um, you feel like safe in this car to be honest you feel really safe you have plenty of space here you can see on my on my legs and and i still have plenty of space on the side um, i think we will see a lot of cars uh, of this caddy on the street uh, because the people will have to to see the car first time to understand how good it is because guys in an utility vehicle like that i call it like that because the shape of it but I feel like it's it's more than that I feel that this utility name is, is not for this car I think like family uh, and and I don't know which which name we should give it but uh, the fact that it has so great technology with the new uh, displays here uh, the multimedia system the new one uh, the cockpit amazing uh, the steering wheel the new technology on the LED lights where you have this adaptive high beam uh, and also it adapt depend on your speed when you drive at low speed the light will adapt and it will show a little bit more but when you drive at high speed the, the light will adapt uh, on the highway accordingly so you have an amazing LED lights latest technology also in the back great space in the back amazing glass roof so i i feel like i'm in, in it's a combination of utility vehicle family car and premium car so somewhere behind those three words uh, we should find this car also the pedals feel really gently they are gentle they are smooth when you press the brake they are so smooth and so nice and i really really like them i appreciate what they do with the pedals and the pedals are the same feeling as you you are driving a golf 8 for example uh the steering wheel is the same um the the easiness the steering it's super super assisted and nice and easy to take the curves it feels good and very good on those curves um i really like the car guys to be honest i think they 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 nail it they make a great job with this car and if you are on the market for a family car you should go and test this uh, new Volkswagen Caddy you, you should see this car because it's it's a great car I tell you it's a it's a really good car 
you will like it for sure I'm sure you will like it and even for companies I think it's a good car uh, because it's super practical if, if you see I will show you in the review guys so uh, uh, check out the review on my channel I will show you that you can take out the seats from from the back you can take it out completely and you can carry a lot of stuff in the back there so you can you can have the car uh, for family trips or carrying people uh, every day and you can have the car for your uh, company so you can you can carry things with the car and uh, I think it's amazing I think it's a great car even if you have animals for example to put it back there they have so much space it's it's quite quite uh, it's quite a good good car to be honest brake great great handlings great on the curves great grip on the steering wheel um, yeah, what you need more than that I think it's just just gorgeous gorgeous to be honest it's it's easy to drive it stay quite good on the curves in the nighttime it looks everything so nice also you get some great consumptions I'm sure about that let's see where is the consumption here You have a lot of technology that blind spot technology, adaptive cruise control. Those are quite quite great options. System systems fuel gauge. Yeah, selector average consumption. Yeah. Okay, 6.5 liter average consumption. Not bad. Not bad to be honest. I like that. I like that consumption here it will show you the the main consumption but we want to have average consumption so we will see in the end uh, what was the consumption if you put the foot down you feel a little bit of power now we go uphill so it's normal but 122 horsepower it's more than enough for this car it feels that you have plenty of power um, so even at, at the uphill, uh, if you have people in the back there, you will don't have any problem uh, with the power. And this this cockpit, this digital new digital cockpit is just crazy good. You have the navigation right there on the screen. You can see all the the information directly there you don't have to look on the right side even though if you look on the right side uh, the placement of the screen here it's very good position it's til tilted a little bit to the driver side so you can have a perfect visibility and I like the way Volkswagen designed this new dashboard this new uh, um, multimedia and the cockpit the way they, they integrate it it's, it's just perfect in my opinion it's just perfect the way it should be um, yeah what can I say guys it's, it's an impressive car also the fact that Volkswagen car have have uh, you can change the pieces and the mechanical stuff you can find it everywhere uh, at least here in Europe to make from this caddy a great buy uh, buy for the bucks you know I mean the quality the, the the things that it offers the fact that if something break you can change it uh, at the at the lower price at the better price um, it, it make it a good good buy to be honest and um, if I was on the market for uh, a car a family car utility vehicle if I have a business where I have to carry or a firma or a small shop uh, where you can carry many things or even a taxi or even a shutter from airport but yeah you cannot carry so many people here but uh, even if you have to, to do these trips like that and you have to carry many luggages you have huge space in the back check out the review to see that and I think makes from this car a super all-arounder you know a very good all-arounder because you have the space you have the 
practicality you have the technology so you have all the words words in this car um, and yeah i think you have heated seats of course uh, i'm not sure if you can get it as an option the, the heated steering wheel probably you can I'm not sure but still you have such an amazing quality in this car and i don't know it's just just it's a good car also you have this kind of a lane assist that help you keep the car between the lanes of course it's not as good as um, Tesla but it's still a great option that can help you sometimes you can see right now it's kind of bouncing a little bit from from side to side but yeah it's, it's, it's a good thing when you don't pay attention to the road it will correct you a little bit so for example here you can see it will just correct you just a little bit so you will stay between the lanes so that's that's a great option and the adaptive cruise control it's working really good it's brake accelerate and it's a nice one it's a nice one you have to you have to test it out um, guys if you are on the market for a car like that you will love this car so uh, if you feel sorry that you probably want to buy a uh, fancy car you want a modern car a sporty car uh, a, a car with a lot of technology and you feel like ah oh, i have to buy this utility vehicle this family car i think this one will make you happy as well because you have this uh new technology here the cockpit uh the steering wheel it's nice and uh, all this technology here usb ports you can connect your android auto apple carplay with the multimedia system you can have everything right there on the screen that make from this car a great uh, box for money so it's it's a good car overall speaking it's a good car it's easy to to drive easy to maneuver um, the pedals are smooth and nice uh, it feel well built that's that's another another uh, sentence that uh, I think it's characterized this uh, new Volkswagen Caddy it's it's the well built very well built Volkswagen really make well built cars I actually had owned two Volkswagen cars before and one Audi car and I never had problem with those cars you know I changed things on time and I never ever had a problem with them so this is this is quite quite cool anyway guys oh the test drive it's already almost uh, ending I think I show you already the the reverse camera here I think it's super easy uh, to park the car you have all the sensors and everything right here you have also the option uh, to park the car automatic you have this park assist uh, right here so it's, it's quite nice uh, to have it as an option but overall the gearbox the, the shift by wire new transmission uh, the fact that it's easy to drive the car make from this Volkswagen really really great buy yeah let me see the consumption guys if we go to vehicle here if we go to data we can see the consumption here since last 710 kilometer 6.2 liter wow pretty good uh, wait a second 60 kilometers 6.2 long terms 1300 kilometers 6.5 since leaf refueling 128 kilometers 6 liters so around there I think you can get better consumption depend you depend on your driving style and the weather because in the last time was winter probably that's why the consumption is bigger but I think with this diesel uh, you can get some around 5 liters without any problem at least in the summertime and yeah depend how you're driving guys that was the test drive i hope you really enjoyed the video i hope you can get some useful information from from this video um as a conclusion the shape of the car is kind of a utility vehicle but i was impressed when i see first time this car i was impressed to see that they add this new multimedia system and the cockpit from from the premium cars and it's it's really a good one if you if you compare it with other cars manufacturer i don't want to give name but this one it's crazy it's insanely good the steering wheel it's gorgeous you find it also on the more expensive cars 
uh, from Volkswagen. The gear shift by wire transmission here, the buttons, the weight, the, the, the easiness of using it, the electronic handbrake, auto hold, the way it looks, everything here, it make it a great car that it's more than utility it's 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 like close to premium it has some elements that are close to premium a lot of new technology for sure this glass roof here it's it's from premium uh side and if you look at the uh, roof uh, the white roof the way they, they design this the way they make it it's it's in a crazy great way and in my opinion it's it's a fantastic car huge space there in the back you will see it in the review uh plenty of space here and there beautiful design of the dash and, and the things and the elements right here so overall great car you will never go wrong if you buy this car uh, and the diesel engine it's a great option if you drive many kilometers uh, every day and you need to save some money so will be interesting to see this new Volkswagen Caddy in the electric version that will be really interesting guys anyway thank you for watching as always i really appreciate that you're watching my videos uh don't forget to like share that will mean a lot for me uh don't forget to subscribe if you want to see the other video with the car for example the full review interior exterior the all almost all new cars that come on the market will be on my channel so just click the subscribe button to see the notification if you like the music in the video you have the link in the description also check out or new New website where you find all kind of information about the cars also uh, videos about the cars and technical data and stuff like that it's the adancars.com thank you for watching stay safe guys and I guess I see you soon bye